Hi and welcome to another MySDCCD training video. Uh, today we're going to cover the steps of what to do when you forgot your password or if you need to change your password. Uh, for, so from the portal, uh, my.sdccd.edu, uh, you want to click on the forgot your password link right here. Uh, the first thing it's going to do is going to prompt you for your uh, user ID. Again, this is the 10-digit user ID that uh, showed on the welcome email that we sent you. Um, the email looks something similar to this. Uh, if you do not have access to your welcome email, you can also contact us at the help desk, 619-388-6800, uh, or you can email us at myhelp at sdccd.edu, or you can visit us uh, at the admissions office on campus, or you can visit the uh, continuing education student services office at your local CE campus as well. Uh, just make sure that you do bring a photo ID with you. Um, otherwise, if you do know your user ID, all you have to do is type in the user ID in the account user ID field and hit submit. Uh, if it validates that as a, a user ID that exists, what it's going to do is it's going to prompt you for your uh, security questions. So in which case here, you're going to put in the answers to the security questions you provided to when you set up your account. Keep in mind, it is case and space sensitive. Uh, so you want to make sure you type in exactly what you typed in uh, when you entered in the security questions. And then finally, you want to put in your date of birth and then hit submit. If any of this information is incorrect, it'll let you know um, that one of your security questions is incorrect and you'll have to try again. Uh, if you do try it too many times, it may lock your account. Uh, so if you are having difficulties, please feel free to visit the admissions office on campus or contact us at the help desk and we'll be able to assist you. Um, once it is able to validate you, then you can go ahead and type in a new password. Again, it has to meet the same uh, password requirements. So again, that's uh, 10 characters in length, uh, cannot contain your name or user ID, and has to have three of the four character types. So that's uppercase, lowercase, numbers, and special characters. So once you enter that information, go ahead and hit submit. And I'll let you know that your password has been successfully changed. If it doesn't meet the requirements, I'll let you know. Just have to make sure that it meets all of those requirements for your password. And then you can go ahead and click on log into uh, log into your account. If you wish to change your password reset questions, you can go ahead and click on this link. This allows you to go ahead and change them. Otherwise, you can click on this login page and go ahead and log in using the new password that you just created. Um, this concludes our training on how to recover your password. Um, thank you so much, and please uh, be sure to check out the rest of our videos.